I'm Alex from Maranta Sound Academy and today I wanted to talk to you about um, this little bowl that got into my position about a week ago and for the last several days I've been um, testing it and um, trying it out in a different situation and I'm really very fond of it now. <laughs> so um, this, this is the latest offering from the Akama. Um, I'm quite excited about it because not very often we get a new ideas from the singing bowl manufacturers and um, it is new. Um, so it, it has this little handle, they, you know, you might call it amplifier in the center. It's um, attached to the bowl directly and it's attached, I think it might be glued or something. It's probably glued to it. Uh, but uh, it's quite sturdy, so you don't see it move or wobble, or, or it's quite safe even when you when you hold it. So, um, what it's supposed to do? It's supposed to strengthen the vibration and the uh, the sound. You can hear the um, binaural beats, and it has really lovely overtones. So overall, it it has got very rich, lovely sound. And also quite strong vibrations. You can you can feel that they are quite uh, intense. Um, as I said, this is a universal ball, so you can use it uh, universally on every uh, part of the body, depending on what uh, mallet you use. Uh, you can extract different sounds. I will in a minute uh, show you comparison of this ball with another universal bowl, so you'll be able to see um, you know, how it compares to the other bowl. Uh, subjectively, my personal opinion, that the um, vibrations are stronger than the other bowl, but um, you, you run with our handle amplifier thing and the other one without um, both universal bowls and we'll, we'll try them out. So here is the harder mallet. We'll um, strike them both together. I can still hear the vibrations and I can feel them if, they, if I touch them, they both vibrate. Now the sound is not audible, but the vibrations are still there. So this bowl uh, goes vibrating for a little bit longer. This is very hard, hardly now noticeable, but this one is still going. So let's try with the softer mallet. This this mallet here. Again, now it's very barely audible, but the vibrations are still there. And I, I do have a uh, feeling that um, this bowl expires faster 
with its vibrations. The sound pretty much goes the same, but this one expires a bit, bit faster in terms of vibrations than this. That's probably due to the amplifier here, which takes out the uh, disperses vibrations a bit quicker. This uh, little um, implement can be used in both ways. Uh, it can be used as an amplifier, so you can strike the ball in such a way, like so. See, it has a really nice sound. And, um, and, but also, you can hold it, the ball just by this handle, okay? And you can strike it in this way. Um, and that's, that's also very nice. The, as I said, this handle is quite sturdy, so I'm not really worried that it's going to drop off or anything. And I've been doing this for, for a week now. I can't see a difference in how it's, um, how it's holding on uh, to the ball. So it definitely is much better than those suction cups or um, nicer to, uh, to work with than, uh, for example, the Peter Hess kit where you've got a little hole in the ball and, uh, and you screw the handle on. You know, obviously when, you, when you're holding the ball uh, like so, you would use it with uh, people who are quite frail and you, you don't really want to rest the whole uh, heaviness of the ball on their body or somebody in the wheelchair that you can basically do the sound massage for them in this way and guide the ball on their body or for yourself as well. Uh, it's a very very good quality ball so um, it can be a really useful for somebody who's, who starts um, who wants to um, have a one decent ball to use for here I have the little app that tells me what are the notes and what are the frequencies of the ball as you can see it changes as I speak so we will we will try to um, to figure out what are the main notes and what are the frequencies in the ball here we go we strike it first with the hard mallet So as you can see, the, uh, the frequencies are 312 and 118, and also D4 and A2. Uh, let's try with the, with the softer mallet. Oh, one more time. So again, 312 and 118 predominantly. Um, it is very, very nice ball, as I said, for, um, for somebody who is a practitioner and wants to supplement the, um, the set of balls or for somebody who, um, who just wants the ball for themselves or want to use it for uh, personal use or for their family. Um, very nice, most recommended. Thank you.